Almighty and ever living God, who sent your Son into the world to cast out the power of Satan and the spirit of evil, to rescue us from the kingdom of darkness and bring us into the splendor of your kingdom of light. We pray now for this child. Set her free from original sin, make her a temple of your glory, and send your Holy Spirit to grow with her. We ask this through Christ our Lord. May you have strength and the power of Christ our Savior, who lives and reigns forever and ever. My friends, we now ask God to give this child new life and abundance through water and the Holy Spirit. You called your daughter, Ainsley Mary, to this cleansing water, that she may share in the faith of your church and have eternal life. By the mystery of this consecrated water, lead her to a new and spiritual birth. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Parents and godparents who come here to present Ainsley Mary for baptism. By water and the Holy Spirit, she is to receive the gift of new life from God, who is love. On your part, you must make it your constant care to bring her up in the practice of the faith. See that the divine life which God gives her is kept safe from the poison of sin, to grow always stronger in her heart. Along with this assembly, who are here to support and sustain your efforts, and if your faith makes you ready to accept this responsibility, renew now the vows of your own baptism. Reject sin, profess your faith in Christ Jesus. This is the faith of the church. This is the faith in which Ainsley Mary is about to be baptized. And so I ask you, do you reject sin so as to live in the freedom of God's children? You reject Satan, the source of sin, and the prince of darkness. Do you believe that you Reject the glamour of evil and refuse to be mastered by sin. Do you believe in God, the Father, the Light, the Creator of heaven and earth? Do you believe in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried, and rose from the dead, and is seated at the right hand of the Father? Do you believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. This is our faith. This is the faith of the church who we're proud to profess it in Christ Jesus our Lord. Is it your will that Ainsley Mary should be baptized in the faith of the church that we've all professed in? Ainsley Mary. Christ was anointed priest, prophet, and king, so may you live always as a member of his body, 